Hello everyone, and welcome back to the channel. There have been some reports that the second Starship launch may be pushed back to October at the earliest. This is much later than we had anticipated. But if the reports are true, it means we'll have to wait almost a month for the launch. Elon Musk has said that SpaceX has completed everything they need to do on their end, so I'm not sure why the launch would be delayed. However, I'm sure there are good reasons, and we'll just have to be patient. Be patient, Anakin. Elon also says that the second Starship flight has a much higher chance of success than the first one. This is good news, and I'm excited to see the results from this flight. SpaceX recently released a photo of their employees standing in front of the full-stack Starship B9 and S25. The hard work and dedication of the SpaceX team, who are working day and night to make humans a multi-planetary species, is really plausible. While everyone's attention is on the full stack, Booster 10 has been undergoing a cryogenic proofing test at Massey's. Crews at NASA's Michoud Assembly Facility in New Orleans have installed the first of four RS-25 engines on the core stage of the SLS rocket. This rocket will launch NASA's Artemis II mission, the first crewed Artemis mission to the moon. The mission is currently scheduled to launch in November 2024. It's worth noting that the mobile launcher has been undergoing testing at Pad 39B which will support the launch operations of this mission. Finally, Rocket Lab is currently testing the propellant tank of the upper stage of its upcoming neutron rocket. The tank will be subjected to cryogenic and pressure tests to ensure its structural integrity and performance. These tests are a critical step in the development of the neutron rocket, which is designed to carry larger payloads to orbit than Rocket Lab's current electron rocket. That's all for now. Thanks for watching.